Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to be doing a weekend morning cleaning routine. So as you can tell, we have been relaxing and I have not been worried about cleaning up. So this is the aftermath and the result of that. My house is a mess. I have little fingerprints and sticky food all over the coffee table and trash everywhere. And my daughter is obsessed with making slime. So I have that. And yeah, everything is pretty messy. So this is also going to be a collab with my friend Becky, and I am going to go ahead and let her introduce herself right now. Hi everybody, my name is Becky. My channel is A Place to Nest. I am a stay-at-home mom of two girls. I have a 13-year-old and a 7-year-old, and we also homeschool, so we're pretty busy around here, but I find time to upload to my YouTube channel every single week. I like, I like to keep it very well-rounded. I do a variety of topics on my channel about cleaning and organization, mom life, fitness, planning, Disney vacations, family life. So I really do try to make my channel well-rounded and I hope you guys will enjoy today's video where Jessica and I are gonna be sharing our Saturday morning cleaning routines. So make sure you check the links for my channel and my video in Jessica's description box so that you can check out my video, spend a little time on my channel, look around, hopefully you'll like what you see and you will subscribe and become part of my YouTube channel family. See you soon. So I'm gonna go ahead and tackle this mess and today is gonna be more of a super motivating theme. I know my last one was very relaxing and a lot of you all enjoyed that, I did as well. Those are probably my favorite to make but I figured that I needed to make one that was a little bit more upbeat this week so that's what I'm gonna do. The great yellow sun is reflecting in your deep blue eyes. The day has begun. You spin around, you spin around, you laugh to yourself. And I see you shining every color, resting your head in my arms. You sing. So I was just using this lemon shine cleaner that I picked up the other day and I really like it. Um, it's not necessarily my favorite but I like it and it says it's safe to wood, use on wood and pretty much everything so it's kind of like a multi-surface cleaner but it's more marketed to be like a Windex but a, like an all natural one. But anyways, it does a fine job and honestly the reason I chose to clean with it today is because it was already on the counter and I was just wanting to get this done. So that's what I grabbed and I pretty much used that to do my wiping down of the living room stuff and the countertop. So yeah, that's what I did. I think I got it at Walmart, but I'm not positive. But yeah, it's just like an all natural Windex. I get a lot of questions about that drawer that I just opened there and I got that at Hobby Lobby and somebody even asked me what I keep in it. So if you're curious as well, I just keep like pens and our bills in there. So that's pretty much all that I keep in there and I got it at Hobby Lobby. Oh, no. 
So I am super excited to share this with you guys. These are the Simply Earth subscription boxes and they are essential oils. So if you like essential oils or making your own all natural cleaners, then this subscription box is for you. And this is the November box and it comes with all these things to make your own kits and then those little recipe cards that you see right there, which is really neat. And then it comes with the diffuser as well. And if you look in the description box, I will have a code for you guys to get, if you get the subscription box, you can get a $40 gift card or a um, $10 off an oil, I think it is. Anyways, I will have all the, the information in the description box, but yeah, I really like these oils. They're 100% pure, and this little diffuser, it, you can't even tell on camera, but it's super tiny, and I just really like it, and I had put the citrus in the cleaning one in there, and it made my kitchen smell so fresh and clean. I was really enjoying that while I was cleaning, and yeah, I'm going to do in one of my upcoming cleaning videos, I'm going to make some of those recipes for you guys and use the cleaners and tell you what I think. So now I'm just throwing a load of rags in because I had ran out and I'm just using some detergent and then my new favorite thing of life which is this odor cleanse laundry additive and it makes your towels and your rags smell so fresh. I can't even explain it. I'm obsessed with smelling them now and a lot of you had recommended doing a lot of other things but I'm telling you what this stuff is like none other. I really recommend it and I will have a coupon for you guys in the description box to get 15% off. They also have a lot of other odor type products so like if you were to need to get smoke out of um, your clothing or lots of different stuff. Just go on their website and have a look around, but I really like that laundry stuff and it will be a staple item in my home from now on. And that is all the stuff that I left there for Maddie to take upstairs because that is her job and she was not home. So I'm just vacuuming as usual, so I sped that up really fast because I always vacuum and if you're new here, my vacuum is in the description box. So I'm just doing that really quickly and then I'm going to show you guys my little floor cleaner here. So what ended up happening was I realized my mop head was in the load of rags and I had no mop. Well, I didn't have a deep clean mop because my floors were pretty filthy. So I broke out this Hoover and I'm using some pine saw. By the way, I don't like that pine saw. I like the original. I'm just trying to use it up. You just put some water and I put pine saw in there. I'm a rebel. I break the rules. They say you're supposed to put their cleaner in there, but I've always just put like pine saw in there and it's been fine. I, I got this machine when Kinsley was crawling and the reason was because I was mopping every day and no matter what I did, her little legs on the knees on her pants and stuff would get so dirty and it was driving my OCD crazy. So I went out and I bought this thing. It was like $100 at Walmart and I used it every day when she was crawling and it totally eliminated the problem of her getting dirty knees. And it just does a really good job of cleaning. So this is something I only break out when I just wanna do like a really good deep clean. And I'm gonna show you in a second all of the little features, but it just has like four spinny scrub brushes on the bottom and you can pop that out very easily and clean it and it has a wash and a dry cycle and then it has a trigger to spray out the solution and then it also has a trigger to spray out extra solution if you had like a bigger mess and then it has um, two little tanks there one is for your cleaning solution and one of the tanks is for all the nasty water that it sucks back up I really like this thing um, but I don't use it as often as I did. I just kind of break it out every now and again if I want to really scrub the floors down. But if you have a crawling baby or something like that, maybe your circumstances are different, I would recommend a machine like this because I do think it does a good job. As you can see, the water there was practically black, which is absolutely disgusting. The great yellow sun is reflecting in your deep blue eyes The day has begun You spin around, you spin around You laugh to yourself And I see you shine in every color Resting your head in my arms You sing la 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 My God, I think I might be in love Get rid of all your sorrows So 
And now I'm just cleaning the half bath that Kinsley uses during the day. I'm using my Clorox and Tibia to spray down the toilet, her stool, and the floor. And then I'm gonna use my Method Sea Salt and Lime to clean up the sink. And I was having some focusing issues today with my camera, so I do apologize. A lot of my clips were out of focus. I'm gonna have to figure out what's going on. But yeah, so I'm just cleaning up the sink real quick and then I'm gonna go over and finish the toilet and then I'm gonna use my toilet wands, which are my favorite. If you've been watching me, you know that. I'll never go back to a regular toilet bowl cleaner because these things are amazing. And I just found out that they sell different scents in them as well. Like I normally use the blue ones. I forget what scent they are, but they have a green one and it's a different scent. I think I have those upstairs in Maddie's bathroom. But just so you know, they do have different scents and you can get them on Amazon. They're really cheap. I think to buy the whole system to start you out with like the little um, handle and the container there is like seven or eight dollars and then you can get the refills for really cheap as well um, I'll have them linked for you below if you're interested but these things are a game changer love 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 them if I could recommend anything at all I would recommend these things they are great so thank you so much for watching when you are done go check out Becky's video if you would like and thank you so much Becky for collabing with me and if you are coming over from her channel hello and welcome and I hope you will decide to stick around and subscribe don't forget to give this video a thumbs up I love you guys and I will see you next time